Hey Taurus, I hope you're doing well. This is going to be a reading for now until Sunday. Any information you need, you can find it in the description box down below. Taurus, I do have personals open right now. It's actually a same day special going on. It's a three question video reading. You get it within 24 hours. It's 3535. Um, what else? What else? That does close tomorrow, July 6th at 11 a.m. Eastern Time. So details are down below, Taurus. Of course, only if you're interested. But we're going to go ahead and begin here and see what we've got for you. Starting off strong with the lovers, okay? So the lovers energy showing up. So maybe there could be a big decision coming up here over the next two days. Or a big turning point, possibly within a connection for some. Maybe with the Gemini, but it doesn't have to be. Six of Pentacles. So maybe a big decision about money or where you're putting money, where you're putting time and resources. Some of you, it's like, do I move here or do I move there? I feel like there's a big life decision um, that I feel like you're like going back and forth about here with the Six of Pentacles energy, figuring out like, what do I give my time and attention to? What do I make a priority? Uh, some of you here, you could have a, a Taurus, Libra, or a Gemini moon, but you don't have to. You could be dealing with someone um, who has one of those placements, but I do see there's something here with like figuring out who to give to as well for some of you, or this could be someone you're dealing with here. You have Queen of Pentacles, Capricorn energy showing up also. Let's see what else we have here. Cause I do, I do feel like you commit to something over the next two days here. Maybe you're committing to something on this day. You're like, this is what I'm going to do. This is what I'm going to go with. Queen of Pentacles, like that's somebody who is committing to something here. She's putting in the work. What else do we have here? Five of Cups, my goodness. Okay, something's draining you about that. Some of you, you could be beating yourself up about a decision that you've made here to like put in more work or to some of you give something a second chance here. Yeah, let's see what else we have here. Oof, yeah. Nine of Swords is like grief, anxiety, stress, sleepless nights, seven of wands. Yeah, I feel like the more this goes on over the next two days, the crazier it gets because it seems to me as if there's... There's something here where you're trying, you're trying to turn a situation around and somebody's resistant to it with that seven of wands energy here. It's like there are relationship obstacles. I feel like you're trying to have some sort of breakthrough and there's someone here who just keeps coming up with new problems. Um, that's the best way I can describe that energy. It's like, or they're like, well, we can't do this because I have this going on. And you're like, well, that's fine. Well, you know, we could work around that like this. And they're like, no, 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 no. <laughs> you know, it's like, there's, there's always something else here is the best way I can describe this energy, Taurus, over the next two days. Or somebody where there's just a lot of excuses. A lot of excuses that's stressing you out. You're like, just be straightforward with me. Just be honest with me. That's the energy that I feel you in. Um, you know, trying to get over like some sort of hurdle in a relationship here, or in a friendship, and somebody is just not cooperating, you know? Um, they're just coming up with a problem for every solution you have. That's the best way I can describe that. Um, I do think for some of you, you're going to be finding out some sort of truth in a situation here that's leading to a change over the weekend. What is that surrounding there? The hair font, a commitment, possibly another Taurus or a Scorpio. We got Aquarius. So you got a lot of fixed energy here. Aquarius, Taurus, Scorpio, Leo. You also have a few cards that would represent Gemini energy as well. So yeah, Taurus, I mean, I just really feel as if there's something where you you keep pushing to make something right, basically, and you keep getting hit with resistance. Um, you know, it's weird. It's craziness. And I feel like somebody really just needs to be straightforward with you here about this. Um, and I'm not sure what's going on, but you do have a lot of court cards here, which typically represent people. I mean, you have the Queen of Pentacles, you have the King of Cups, King of Swords, which it doesn't really matter whether male or female, but I feel like there could be more than one person influencing a situation here, possibly family or some other form of commitment that's influencing someone's decisions here in regards to money or time or like what they actually genuinely invest in emotionally. So yeah, Taurus, pretty crazy energy here over the next two days, but I feel like Trying to get honesty out of a person here is like pulling teeth, you know? And I think that that is truth enough, you know? So that's what I'm seeing here for you, Taurus. I hope that this was helpful or fun or whatever you needed it to be. Details are down below for anybody who's interested in personals, Instagram, or Patreon. Okay, I do have that same day special open. Like I said, it's three questions. It's a video reading. You get it uh, within 24 hours, but that does close tomorrow. Um, July 6th at 11 a.m. Eastern Time. It's 3535. Okay, all the details are down there. But if this is where we part, thank you for being here, Taurus. I really appreciate you, and hopefully I'll see you next time. Bye.